In addition to the internal 30 millimeter cannon, the SC-25T can also carry up to four SPPU-22-1 external gun pods. Each pod contains two GISH-23L autocannons that contain 260 23 millimeter rounds. The fire rate for the cannons is 3,000 rounds per minute and have an effective range of around 2 currently in active pause as we discuss its use. Press the spacebar to continue. Enter air to ground mode by pressing 7. Activate the gun by pressing C. On the weapon status panel, you will see that we have four wing stations loaded. Each of these contain a single gun pod. You will also note that we have a full ammunition load indicated by the K. Press the spacebar to continue. Let's take a look at the Weapon Systems Control Panel in the bottom left corner of the front dash. Currently, the Release Mode switch is set to the Salvo position and the Size switch is set to 1. In this setting, just the internal 30mm cannon is used. Press left control and spacebar once to select the next Salvo position. The Fix option is now selected as the Salvo position and the Salvo Size switch has been set to X2. In this setting, two gun pods are now the active weapons. Inside each of the gun pods, the twin barrels can be depressed to allow you to shoot downwards even when in level flight. When the barrels are depressed, the green light on the panel will light. Let's try this. Press right control and right bracket to depress the gun pods. Notice that when you did so, the range carried on the left side of the HUD decreases due to the change in gun barrel angle. Now try raising the gun barrels by pressing right control and left bracket. Good. To select all four pods in fixed mode, press left control and spacebar again. When you did so, the salvo size switch was set to X4. To set all the gun pods to the boresight position, press left control and spacebar again. When you did so, the salvo position switch was set to the zero position. To return the internal 30mm cannon to the salvo position, and the salvo size switch set to 1, press left control and spacebar one more time. Do this now. Ahead of you, on a small airfield, is a light armor vehicle marked with red smoke to practice on. Set the number of gun pods to use in the depression angle, and then use the aiming reticle on the HUD to line up the shot. When you have the launch authorization cue, Press and hold the space bar to fire the gun pods. Press the space bar to unpause the lesson. Okay, here we go. Nice job. You can see that a rain of 23 millimeter rounds can be quite deadly. I have provided two additional targets marked with green smoke to practice on. You can end the lesson now by pressing escape key when you're ready.
Пуск разрешен. Переведи в набор. Переведи в набор. Предельный угол атаки. Предельная перегрузка. Предельный угол атаки. Предельная перегрузка. Пуск разрешен. Предельный угол атаки. Предельная перегрузка. Предельный угол атаки. Предельная перегрузка. 